Obviously, okay. it got um, tighter at the end, but how, how key was uh, Lillard's first quarter? 16 points, five rebounds, a couple assists, I mean, to set the tone. Yeah, uh, he did. He came out and set the tone for us. He usually does. Um, we just kind of exploited the coverage that they were in. And then they did a good job, actually, of changing the coverage and putting a lot more pressure on him. And, uh, you know, we had to find other guys. I thought Jeremy came out and was very aggressive as well. Um, and then it was just kind of, you know, we had to kind of, they were trapping and we just had to kind of make the right play, you know, when we got to the paint after Dame got off the ball. And I thought we did a pretty good job of it. You've talked a lot, Chauncey, about just the, the lack of size on the team right now, especially with Nurk out. And you have Dame go out and get 13 rebounds tonight. Mm -hmm. um, kind of speaks to kind of his effort all across the board, it seems like to me a little bit. It's not just about scoring, not just about creating. Yeah, yeah, I think you, we all know that, you know, Dame understands the moment, you know. Um, and with Nurk out, it's, it's, been, it's been tough going, you know, especially on the glass. And then we, you know, no longer have Josh Hart, who was our second best rebounder. So we know that we have to kind of do it by committee, you know, and sometimes our big guys get the rebounds and sometimes they just have to kind of keep their guy off the glass and our small guys got to get in there and clean up the glass. So tonight was one of those nights. Triple double for um, for him uh, doesn't have a lot of those. Would you like to see more of those and maybe fewer, you know, fifty point games? I mean, is that more of a winning formula? Or? No, I wouldn't say that. You know, um, I think that he should be getting long outlets and you know us running. You know, um, but because we are kind of small, we we do need him in there right now. He's he's going in there fighting with the big guys, but. Um, you know, he's this type of player that's going to do whatever it takes, you know, on any given night. You know, it could be 50 one night. It could be these crazy numbers that he's putting up. And then some nights it, it could be, you know, 12 assists, 13 rebounds. So uh, he, he's he's prepared to do whatever it takes. I imagine you probably weren't super satisfied with the execution at the end of the game there. Yeah, yeah. I mean, of course, you know me. Uh, I wasn't excited about the fourth quarter at all. Uh, I thought they just, you know, they just junked it up. And um, we had our second group out there. Their pressure really hurt us, and they kind of got themselves back in the game. Um, and, that, that, you know, that's kind of been an issue for us, you know, all season. It's something that we just have to be better at. Chauncey, it seems like most of the talk around the play, and it's been around the Lakers and how they play, but you guys are right there sort of trailing and playing better. Do you feel like you're kind of getting lost in the shuffle in terms of the bigger picture that you're in a position that you want to be in? Yeah, I mean, but you're always going to get lost in the shuffle if, if it's a Lakers, if the Lakers are around your area, you know, um, with the star power that they have and, um, you know, the expectations that they've had all season, you know, you it's understandable. And I don't mind floating under the radar anyway, you know. I just I want to – I want us to kind of get healthy and see if we can make the push that, that, I, that I believe we can.